Hey, it's Justin with HorribleNight.com for our first Necro Game Curious. I kind of came up with this on the spot because Manhunt just came out on the PS4, and I don't know how I missed that announcement or where that came from, but I got super excited and bought it immediately. I have really fond memories of Manhunt. It was one of the coolest PlayStation 2 experiences I had. I remember what really stood out was that it interacted with the microphone. I could make noise in the microphone and get the game to kind of react to it, and I thought that was really cool. Of course, Manhunt got a lot of um, negative attention just for it for its content, for um, being so violent and kind of poster game for violent video games, the mean you know, of the month that it came out or whatnot. But regardless, I, I really like the premise and the fact that the game has Brian Cox in it because he kind of acts as this creepy film director. I think you're like a convict or something. He's just set up this scenario where you have to survive by killing other convicts and so he can make a snuff film, basically. It's a really creepy setup, but Manhunt ended up being a pretty interesting stealth game. I think people wanted it to be more of a balls-out action game, but playing it as a stealth game, it always really stood out in my memory. I remember it being hard. I remember getting stuck halfway through it, but I'm really interested to see uh, if any of the gameplay holds up at all. I, I just want to play it, and I kind of wanted to document it. So here we go, our first Necro Game Curious with Manhunt on PS4. All right, just because this is the first Necro Game Curious that we've done and kind of my first attempt to do these live from the ps4 i kind of wanted to um start from the dashboard here um just so you, we can see manhunt load up i actually haven't played a playstation 2 game um on the ps4 yet so i'm kind of curious how everything everything goes so let's uh let's get into it again i'm playing live so i'll be talking to uh our chat audience throughout this thing i um, not really sure what the final form of this video is going to take, but there's some some old rock star. So this is, what, post Grand Theft Auto 3. I think it definitely, it's post Vice City. I'm not sure. I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure it's before San Andreas. Because like my memory is based on what college apartment I was living in when this game came out. But... Um, I mean, at this point, the name Rockstar had started to get it around. You knew it's the GTA guys, and you knew they're going to be edgy, and they're going to try to um, try to get your attention with their games. And this... Gosh, I'm trying to think if Bully had come out or not. But anyway, like, man, it just seemed different. It just... It, it seemed even more brutal than Grand Theft Auto did. But it got much more mixed reviews and also kind of held down by, um, you know, the negativity around uh, the, the, the violence in the game and that kind of thing. But um, I think if you get... If you just get into the presentation of the game, it's, it's pretty cool. So, all right. Brightness. Box on the left is just visible. I've, I've learned find out when it's just visible and then you go up another notch. Best experience man how you should turn off the lights, close the drapes, lock the door and get ready to kill. Standard level hardest or doing standard. I remember this game's pretty hard so I don't have a memory card in there. Well, that was easy enough. It looks like this goes all the way to the top. I can't trust anyone, least of all the police, and time's running out. I've got to get the one piece Definitely of evidence that the will game. expose Starkweather without a shadow Stark of a doubt. Starkweather, what a Footage name. and testimony of a man who was executed by the state five hours ago. I forgot it was found footage. That makes, that makes James sense. James Earl Cash. <laughs> found guilty and sentenced to death. <laughs> has been on death row for the past three years and was executed Don't look at her mouth. Night. It's not weird. It, I mean, it is. Oh, it's weird. There's Brian Cox. You get a second chance. Another throw of the dice. As far as the Striker world, and sir, what the uh, James James the lead in deputy of um, hey, 
probably some like shock idea. Oh shit, I have the name stuck on it. It's not Starship Troopers, the highway one. God damn it, troopers. Oh, whatever. We'll call it God damn it, troopers. That's better. Oh, yeah. Now so that's when it switched to, like I said, they, they really touted the voice commands in the game. And, it, and so you could play the game with, a, you know, like an earbud in there, a little headset, and, and his voice comes through the headset and not the speakers of the game. It was, it was, it was kind of gimmicky, but also kind of cool because I hadn't played anything like that at the time. Super Troopers. That's it. Starship Troopers. I knew it was Starship Troopers. Just like you. All right. Oh yeah, I gotta kill all the different gangs. And cut you up. I'll try to direct you as best I can, but other than that, you're on your own. He is the director. It's up to you. Okay. Are you ready? Camera. Action. <laughs> can you imagine like the voice recording session and the direction they're giving him? All right. Gosh, early, early DualShock 2, still explaining how the analog works. R1 button to sprint, sprint. you got stamina. Uh, start button, which is now half the touchpad on the PS4 controller. Well, there we go. Doesn't look, I mean, they up everything, so it doesn't look awful. What the hell? So I just tap the right stick, and it goes to first-person mode to look around. You can hear my heartbeat. Hey, look, it's a bald protagonist. See, so you, you only hear the heartbeat when you're looking around in first person. <laughs> I mean, they, they went all the way with the atmosphere. So this was probably after State of Emergency, too. Oh, R1, not R2. Oh, and so you see on the left there... When I run, he's creating noise. Just walk over him. I remember the uh, plastic bag. Plastic bag is the first weapon. The one and the one hunter in there. Gone after use. I like that they call them hunters. Look at that camera. Radar shows location. So this is also post uh, MGS2. Aware, suspicious, and idle. Execute the hunter, this sneak up no behind him. Spend an evening. Okay, I don't know what's the difference between X and square, though. Okay, more vicious, and you gotta, you gotta, you gotta make it good for the camera. Here I am hanging like a limp dick while my Lucy shacked up with he some said free dick. Prick. And that wall says fuck. Yeah, that's one way to teach me how to play the game, so... <laughs> I mean, my instinct, though, is to control the camera. Oh, no, it is... Oh, my God, that's weird. So you can kind of... Oh, never mind. Okay, it's weird. All right, so you're walking around, and the camera's responding to... It's trying to auto-adjust based on the left stick... But if I try to move with, if you're still, and move with the right stick, it'll zoom into first person. But if you're walking and try to use the right stick, it looks at angles. That's and it's kind of inverted there too. All right. Anyway, let's get back to it. How do I? What is that? L L two is on. A, weird. L two and R two are straight, like automatic strafes. You hold them down. That's interesting. What's L? L1 doesn't seem to do anything. Alright. So I'm just going to fight the camera. It's going to be the problem. But let's kill this dude. I mean, kill, let's kill this dumb fuck. Go on! Oh. So held it down and... Until it turned red. How brutal was that? We set that jump up to see if you had what it takes to be our leading man. A That's little so cool. audition, if you will. <laughs> Gotta dump the body. That's a pretty evil laugh there, Mr. Cox. 
Just drop him in the... Oh, and it's... Oh, it's got your... Look at You can tell when you're in the, hidden in the shadows. Nice. All right. I just got to avoid using the... The right stick for the camera. Because that's how modern games work. That's not how this game works. Another plastic bag. We go up the basketball court. Can we climb over this thing? Yeah. I mean, the, you also don't expect the atmosphere of this game. Like, because again, no one really knew what this was when it came out. And he just expected this, this just brutal, fast-paced murder game, and it's a lot slower. Huh. This game's trying to... It's trying to do a lot of things. Here. Oh, and you can see him on the... radar. Okay, we're gonna try triangle this time. <laughs> it's whistling. What the hell was that? Well, I blew that. Oh. Camera sucks. Finish him. Oh, well. Let's go yellow. I don't know what triangle did. We got blood on the camera though. That was one killer shot at a boy. Okay, that's what I accidentally hit that. So triangle scoots him against the wall, turns him, turns him around. All right. Oh, and it does tell you that. Like it's given, it's, it's given you all the info. That's kind of ahead of its time, right? All right. So we got more shit. What's over here? Oh, I need to dump him in the. No, I don't. hasn't taught me about it, so it's not gonna screw me over with it yet. Painkillers. 50% of health. Got it. Can't skip these, though. Jump down. Is that the only way to go? It's that way. Creepy, creepy game. From here on in, we're gonna need some fighting skills to get through the action. We're talking toe to toe. Toe to toe. I know you he enunciates so well. So just give me the best you've got, and you'll deal with this pussy no problem. The gate will open once I'm done filming here. Oh, so we're just gonna. Okay, shitbag. I know Quick it's attack you. and heart attack. All right, shitbag versus shitbag. Do not press any button. You block by just standing there. L1 to lock on. Okay. <laughs> oh, cool. The more the merrier. No. Oh, you gotta hold it. Oh, you want some more, asshole? You like this, you rat bastard? That's one way to display their health. Oh, you all just got me angry now. Give me some help down here! Did they resample the audio? Like, it's actually pretty good. Oh, now he's running away because he's about to die. Let's get some more bodies over here! Get him. Hey, leave some for me! What the hell? He's not dead. 
on, guys. I'm keeping him busy. Do I need to find a, a weapon? Hey, hey, just a game, right? Okay, hombre? No, no, please. No, come on, man. <laughs> Ow. All right, here we come go. Come on, guys, I'm keeping him busy. There we go. You can run and lock on, but you gotta hold down the lock on. Oh, I gotta do some manual saves. Oh. Save point hit. Then. No. There it is. Got it. Weird. It's very, very manual. Man, it's using like the, the entire controller. What did I just pick up? A shiv? Oh, a glass shard. Look at that. Lean. It's the waiting. Always the waiting. They're so talkative. Oh, he probably heard that, didn't he? I'm fighting the camera there. Oh, that works. All right, he's coming back down. Is he coming back down? Oh, shit. Whoops, that was a very stealthy. I'm, I think I got a bloody mark on my head, too. <laughs> Running into trash cans. There's no, like, hunting for items, that's for sure. What do we got here? Did he not see me? I got him, guy. Oh, God. <laughs> Damn it. No. Take it like a <laughs> Hell, you weren't meant for this world anyway. Oh, this oh. is like so easy. That's so much for stealth. Just give up. I am stuck behind this gate. <laughs> Come on, fight like a man! Make the stop hitting this till you die. It's it? Oh shit. It. I can't really turn around very easily. I ain't gonna recognize your body. Okay, at least we get to redo that. <laughs> Snuff him out! <laughs> this jacket just says fucker. Are they fucker or fucked? Are in the eyes. Yes, and that's why you can't buy this game at GameStop. Like it was Judgment Day. This director loves it. Okay, let's um be a little quieter this time and not just bump into the noisy gate. Oh, it's not gonna replay that cutscene. Okay. Must be fried hearing things. 
he, so he saw me from across the way. But did he go out of my... He went out of my... Vision? I think I hear you. There we go. All right, so just stay in the shadows. Where'd the other guy go? God, this camera sucks. Oh shit, oh shit. What you hiding for? Afraid you can't take me? What up, dude? Oh, but I can just stay in here? No, turn around. So I can see him. There we go. There we go. So that's what held the game back, was the camera. So what I'm saying is I should remake this. Oh boy. I shot jump. <laughs> I froze. I tried to hold it towards red, but he started turning. That was actually more gruesome. You, you're getting me all flustered here. What do we got? We got pain pills. I don't need the pain pills yet. But I am out of weapons. So there's no, there's nothing telling me how many dudes there are. There's another plastic bag. Yep. I sold the, there's one on the far side. Let me be the first to get a hold of that freak. Man, that is awful. There's no going around the corners. Man, that's got to be frustrating too. To watch. Where'd he go? Is that him? Over there? And that? Oh shit! There he is. Lots of pain meds, though. I swear, guys. You want to play catch? Why? Go, go, go. Get out of here. That's not working. Run all you want. You're dead anyway. Oh, we got the bastard now. Let's see if I can't run away completely. Nice. Nice. This. Yeah. Congratulate me on my murder. <laughs> At least he made all the gate openings creepy. Okay. There are some more of these shitheads hanging around the exit. Give me some grade A. I feel like he hired these guys, huh? And you'll be buzzed through the door. And just make it fun of them and having me murder them. So lure a hunter by hitting any wall. See that he heard the sound by checking his arrow. Well, how do I hit the wall? Like that. So that was what you could do with the microphone too. Instead of hitting the wall, you could shout. Go. That's not bad. And you just start luring guys closer and closer to you. So will he? Yeah, we got you now. You're dead meat. <laughs> I love the fucking audio in this game. I don't remember it being that crisp. Okay, what's he gonna do? He's gonna come. He's still hanging around in there. 
you know. I see the door. Dang it. I see. <laughs> right. Oh. Don't hide in the shadow. Oh. There. You think you look oh. On you go. Ah. <laughs> I've been using the. You're going too far, man. Too far. Go. Pack. Ah. Farther. Go farther. That's the. Is he the last guy? He's guarding the door. Is there anyone else around here? What the hell is all this? Sh is like I don't know how. I don't think there's really any ex exploration here. It's a shoot. Can I go down there? Sure can. It's dark as hell. Where the hell? What? What? <laughs> okay. So let's go here. I'm coming over there to beat your fucking brains out. Can't see me. So you just lure him. Break him. There we go. So I have to wait for the director to tell me I can stab him. That's the signal. Door's now open. There's no reason to really explore. I just yeah, just go down the chute. Huh. Style points. Why 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 would they need to put fetish in brackets there? Oh, they still tutorial. Give me tutorials. Quick turn. That's what I need. All right. Just, just don't use your. There we go. All right. It's very deliberate, but like it's got all the controls. You just have to fight. I have to fight the urge to use the right stick to control the camera. Just gotta let the camera do its thing. But. Quick turn. Quick turn is exactly what I needed. All right, what's going on here? Oh, cool. So that's how you swap. I don't want the plastic. Why would you want the plastic bag? Always have a weapon. Get me a pile of pots just so high. I can see his security cameras. Oh, he's over here. Where the hell is he? He's behind me. Is he up above? Or is he... Oh, look. As I'm walking on those leaves, it's creating more noise. They, I mean, they paid attention to a lot of details in this game. That's pretty cool. I need to take a leak. I'll be outside. It's just not what people expected. And... It's like if you... If you the hyper-violent crowd wants wants more action and stealth gamers I don't know they're a little this isn't their style you know so it's it's a tough audience is that gonna make noise that should make noise and you can also just kind of say no way to spend an evening you can see them kind of like just f trying to break the GTA engine a bit So I don't think there's any style advantage <laughs> to doing the we'll to holding it down. And, star out of you there we go. Blunt weapons. Wait. Oh, nice. Okay. I didn't actually see what that said. Dang it.
I, I don't think you can do executions with them, is what it said. Can I carry that and? Yeah, you can. So you can use that for melee more. That's a short baseball bat. <laughs> it's more of a billy club, really. <sighs> yeah, just get used to doing that. I just noticed I did heal in between levels. And there's pain meds. All right. I think that means he's up above me. There's a hood upstairs. Mm. Make some noise. Hit something. That should get his attention. <laughs> Here I am hanging like a Brian Cox's while my Lucy shacked up with some freaking prick. <laughs> that didn't get his attention? Oh, here he comes. I don't want to know what Brian Cox is doing while he's watching these videos. So now I can switch. You can't hide all night. We're gonna find you. Nah, he's not over here. So you get him to turn around. But I can't. There we go. Oh, he raises the weapon. I mean, you gotta, gotta hold it. So oh, different angle. <laughs> oh man. Those PS2 murders. So graphic. I mean, you still don't want your kids to see it, but... But come on. Especially, they, they had no idea where we were going as far as realism <laughs> at this point. Okay, don't have the... Okay, I just have the bat now. There's another dude in here. Is that corner dark? Yeah, it is. I think it's pretty much the main component of the game. It's still teaching me. Is that gravel? Yeah, but if I go super slow, it won't do it. But I don't have a weapon. I think there was one. Just have the bat, so we're gonna just bludgeon him, I guess. It kind of makes me want want to see Rockstar do an actual horror game. Gosh, so that's where I mess up. Oh, you can't execute. Okay, so that's just the only difference is you get to reuse them. I don't know why I didn't think you could execute. I know I don't have to move these guys, but it's good to get in the habit of it anyway. I I still really like this game. Fix the camera and it's... Fix the camera and I'd love to see updated AI. I mean, they're... It's pretty simple to this to point. But to bust that padlock. I have a baseball bat. Look at their tutorial, though. They're stepping you through this. I can't, now, I don't think you can bust out lights, though. That would be kind of helpful. I don't think I've even come across a save point. Right analog stick to view your surroundings. Use it to spot hunters at a distance. Shit. I could have sworn. Where was he? How was he raising that bat? Getting getting off the wall is a problem. Who's that? Ah, shit. Shit. Kind of 
Get him, gonna get him. Come on, stay sharp. I can walk faster than you. I'm gonna beat your ass. Oh shit, he's on the jet. Here's the cow. Oh. Shouting before he turned around. That was where you failed. Big weapons. Oh, so it wasn't a bat. What the hell was I using? Really was a club. Okay. Oh, guess not. Where'd he go? What was that? Keep it sharp. Break off the wall and chase him Sometimes easily. Sometimes I think I must have been hallucinating. That's the problem. See now I'm turned around. Ugh. Never mess with the hoods. I ain't stop. Don't kill me. Why wouldn't I? That's too bad. I really wanted to execute that guy. Give her an adequate bid. She will cruise herself. <laughs> that dialogue's hilarious. Gonna string him up and have some fun. Tear him up! Oh! You won't last long if you let the world and his wife know where you are. Oh. Let me live and I'll help you. I swear! <laughs> What's going on over here? Somebody's over here. Here's the crowbar, you wanker. Wanker? Oh, well, I guess they... They are in England. Where's the crowbar? Whoa, whoa, go, shit! I see you. Let's You're see. a fucking dead man. Go, go, go. Lock onto him. Kick his ass, boys. Kick the shit out of him. There we go. Get off me. That did scare the hell out of me. Thought I was missing the crowbar. That would be ideal for smashing a padlock, say. Say. <laughs> Hired him for his laugh. Still getting rolling, though. Can I jump down? Shit. Oh, for heaven's sake! Heaven's sake. Oh, that's how you do it. Oh boy. Oh, he found the body. It's going all the way upstairs. Where the hell's he going? There we go. That was an accident. You're going to be screaming your name, boy. I'm gonna 
You're all mine now, shitbag. Oh, I, I want to you should damn head think, man. Think. Oh, I got this. Please. I guess they kind of repopulate the level. I dig it. Man. Yeah, don't let me tell you this game's not good, because it's good. It's different. Totally killing somebody with this crowbar. Music's getting creepy. Something's something's down here. Where the hell are we going? Oh, apparently we can open that door. Find his. Oh shit! Now we got a battle. Okay. The leader of the hoods. This is what I like to call a setup. <laughs> this guy will fight dirty, but once you're through with him, I'll open the next door. Okay. He wants a fight scene. Press the X button and it's still teaching me stuff, huh? Okay. Just keep hitting the bastard. Oh. Ah. 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 You're just making me mad! Alright, let's do this. There we go. I never saw you. No mercy. Open that door. I'm not a very good fighter. Ah, two out of three style points. Fetish. Just call them fetish points, man. It's fine. That's fine. I think it starts getting ramping up here. Well, we haven't run into the second gang yet, though. So I wonder how many tutorials they have left. X button to kick this trash can and use it as a lure. No, I want the shiv. Just hold the... Uh, I don't want to do that. Hey, I got your number, whoever you are. Come on out, buddy. Time to party. Nothing here, just wind. Dang it. Oh! <laughs> That's a crowbar. That's what they paid to see, right? So it took me about a, about an hour to kind of find a little bit of a groove. But you can see, I, I feel like people even gave up on the tutorial. Because I remember I probably only got four or five levels in. But I also had never really played a game like this, so it wasn't that I didn't like it. It was that it was um, it, it was harder than I expected, and that probably that drove me away more so than the design or the style of game. It was, it was probably some other game I wanted to play or something. That tends to be how I work. Move aside. Help oh, shit. Where did he go? Where the hell did he come from, man? Back up, back away, back away. I'm gonna open you up. No, you're not. Oh shit. Yeah, he is. <laughs> 
I'd say that was a failure. That's a good place to stop, though. Man, Hunt. Got it? All right. So I think Manhunt's better than I remember. It's uh, definitely a little rough to kind of get in the groove. I, the controls weren't great to begin with, and they haven't aged very well. But once you once you get used to it, the tutorial definitely has a very methodical pace to it. But it does show you everything, and the controller does what you need it to do. It's just, especially at the beginning, it didn't unveil uh, everything that it could do, so I was fighting it a lot. If it had just, like, dumped everything at once and then kind of walked me through step by step, I think that would have worked better for me, but I really struggled with trying to lean against the wall and then break off the wall to go do a quick attack, but the atmosphere in that game is awesome. Just the kind of moment-to-moment -moment stealth scenarios are, are, are really cool, and how quickly it can kind of get out of hand. It, it, it definitely, I feel like it appeals to a limited audience, like I was kind of saying on... on in the video that hyper violent fans and stealth fans don't necessarily overlap all that much but if you kind of treat it more as a, a a murder murder puzzle game like um a slower paced you know hotline miami or super hot that might be uh, a more a better modern take on it but uh uh, it's 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 satisfying when you when you pull off a good stealth kill. I really like the the uprising on the PS4. It seems like they found a good balance of like minimal effort to get those out, but bringing back some classics like this is really smart. So uh, I was really glad to play Manhunt again. It holds up well. I'd like to see them revisit it, um, but at this point in 2016, I, you don't need to lean into you know the torture porn aspect of it. But that's coming out around the Saw movies and the Hostel movies, like that. That era's kind of gone gone by. So it's not. I'm not there for the violence, but you know, like I said, the the, the stealth kills. It's it's got a you know a, a much different atmosphere than say like an Assassin's Creed. And Manhunt feels unique, and that's kind of why I like it. And it's it's very thoughtfully uh, designed. It appeals to a certain type of gamer, but um, uh, I really like it, and I'm glad they. Uh, re-released it. That's pretty cool. So Manhunt's out now on PS4 and, you know, some retro devices. PS2, get that little, get your little headset and microphone and yell uh, to att attract all those gang members so you can kill them. Uh, it's fun. Uh, for HorribleNight.com, and this was our first Necro Game Curious. Let us know what you what you thought about it. And I'm, I'll revisit some more of my favorite older games later and maybe some more ps2 releases on ps4 and uh, other platforms i'll i'll definitely if they keep putting out the games that i remember and really like i'll i'll definitely check them out so uh that's it thanks everybody we'll see you